For eons it traveled through the cosmic dark, a silent testament to a planetary system we may never see. This object, 3I Atlas, journeyed through the vast emptiness between the stars, a relic from the dawn of another world. Gravitational nudges from a giant planet could have flung it into the interstellar abyss. Its surface was scarred by cosmic rays, but deep within, primordial materials remained pristine. Then something changed. It wandered into the gravitational domain of our sun, its path bending into a hyperbolic curve. As it fell deeper into our solar system, the sun's warmth began to stir the ancient ices within. It crossed the Kuiper Belt, zipping past the orbits of the giant outer planets. The sun grew larger and brighter, sublimating its surface and forming a faint, ghostly shroud. The silent traveler was waking up, preparing to put on a spectacular show. Its long, cold slumber was about to end. The journey inward accelerated, and the wanderer was on a collision course with the inner solar system. A brief, fiery encounter awaited. The discovery happened on July 1, 2025, flagged by the Atlas system in Hawaii. At first it seemed like any other near-Earth asteroid, but its trajectory was a wide-open hyperbola. This was the cosmic signature of an object from beyond our solar system. The news spread like wildfire. This was only the third confirmed interstellar visitor. Unlike Oumuamua and Borisov, Atlas was spotted on its way in giving us a precious window of opportunity. Scientists around the world dropped everything for this once-in-a-generation event. Interstellar objects are our only direct samples of material from other star systems. Atlas represented a tangible piece of another world, delivered to our doorstep. Initial observations showed it was active, behaving like a comet by releasing gas and dust. Atlas was projected to make a close pass by the Sun and then swing by Mars. This was an incredible stroke of luck, allowing us to study it with Earth-based telescopes and Mars orbiters. The scientific community was galvanized, eager to study this messenger from the stars. We had a unique, fleeting chance to unlock the secrets it carried. No one wanted to miss a single moment of its historic visit. With 3I Atlas hurtling toward the sun, the global scientific community mobilized swiftly. This was a race against orbital mechanics. The comet would be in our neighborhood for only a few months. Astronomers from NASA, ESA, and National Observatories coordinated their efforts. Telescope time was rapidly reallocated, freeing up our most powerful observatories. A continuous observation campaign was launched using a global network of telescopes. Ground-based telescopes focused on tracking its path and analyzing its light for clues about its composition. The Hubble Space Telescope captured ultra-sharp images of the comet's nucleus and inner coma. Space-based observatories specializing in different wavelengths also pointed toward the visitor. The James Webb Space Telescope was the star of this campaign, perfectly suited to study a cold, icy body like Atlas. The goal was to create a detailed chemical inventory of the comet. The entire world of astronomy held its breath, waiting for the data to come in. The James Webb Space Telescope turned its golden eye toward 3I Atlas, revealing spectacular results. Using its advanced spectrographs, the JWST broke down the faint infrared light from the comet's coma into a rainbow of data. The spectrum acted like a chemical barcode, confirming the presence of water, H2O. This monumental discovery suggested water is a common building block in planetary systems across the galaxy. The JWST also detected carbon dioxide, CO2, hinting that Atlas may have formed in a colder region of its home protoplanetary disk. The most thrilling discovery was the detection of complex organic molecules, the fundamental building blocks of life. These findings provide strong evidence for the theory of panspermia, suggesting comets could transport prebiotic materials between star systems. The precision of the JWST's data allowed scientists to measure the relative abundances of these molecules. Atlas was indeed an alien, a product of a different stellar nursery with its own distinct chemical history. As astronomers collected more images of 3Y Atlas, it became clear this visitor was behaving strangely. Its coma was not a smooth, uniform haze, but a clumpy, fragmented structure. High-resolution images revealed jets and fans of material erupting from multiple active sites on the nucleus. This suggested the surface wasn't a uniform block of ice and rock but a jumble of different materials. The comet's tail was just as peculiar, displaying a complex, filamentary structure. It appeared to have multiple, twisting streamers of dust and gas, suggesting a complex interaction with the solar wind. 
these physical differences from our local comets were profoundly important. Comets are considered pristine fossils from the formation of a solar system. Atlas's unique structure suggested that the conditions in its home system were not identical to ours. By studying its strange shape, we learn about the diversity of planet-forming environments in our galaxy. As September 2025 unfolds, the astronomical community anticipates three Juan Atlases close flyby of Mars. In late October, the comet is projected to pass just a few million kilometers from the red planet. This is an extraordinary scientific opportunity, with Mars perfectly positioned for observation. Orbiters like NASA's Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter and ESA's Trace Gas Orbiter are repurposed for the flyby. These spacecraft will capture detailed images of the nucleus and inner coma. The spectrometers on these orbiters will study the comet's outgassing with unprecedented detail. There's even a chance of a unique meteor shower as dust particles enter Mars's atmosphere. This Martian encounter is a critical part of understanding 3I Atlas. The data from Mars orbiters will complement observations from Earth and the JWST. The flyby will be a short but intense period of observation before Atlas speeds away. The visit from 3I Atlas leaves a lasting impact on our understanding of the universe. Objects like Atlas are cosmic messengers, carrying vital information from distant star systems. With interstellar objects, we can study actual material formed in those systems. Each visitor gives us a new sample helping us understand the variety of planetary recipes across our galaxy. The discovery of water and complex organic molecules in Atlas reinforces the idea that the building blocks of life are common. These ingredients appear to be scattered throughout the Milky Way, suggesting the potential for life is widespread. Interstellar comets could be part of a galactic delivery system seeding planets with prebiotic chemistry. Studying the differences between Atlas and our comets is crucial to understanding planetary systems. Each new object refines our models and challenges our assumptions about solar system formation. Interstellar objects connect us to the larger cosmos, reminding us of our cosmic origins. As Atlas recedes into the darkness, we are left with a sense of wonder and a deeper understanding of our place in the universe.